Imagine space as a colossal colander, pitted with holes of all shapes and sizes. Some are just a smidge bigger than our sun, while others are billions of times more massive. From radio signals to mind-bending gravitational waves, we've found black holes all over the cosmos. Einstein's theory of general relativity nailed their description, so far so good. But even Einstein left us hanging on two massive questions. What happens to the stuff that falls into a black hole? And do black holes ever really die? Decades ago, Stephen Hawking showed us that black holes don't last forever. They slowly evaporate by emitting what we now call Hawking radiation. Over a mind-boggling amount of time, they shrink down to almost nothing. But then what? That's where things get really wild. Here's the latest twist. A theory called loop quantum gravity. It suggests that inside a black hole, quantum effects get so strong that they actually create a repulsive force, one powerful enough to make the collapsing core bounce 